I'd say L'Amour has a very eclectic style, if that's what we want to call it. I think she's really gorgeous. <laughs> From here up. <laughs> Surprise! Hi! L'Amour? Yes. You're here for your callback, right? Yes. Well, actually, we're gonna do your makeover in the elevator. What? <laughs> Welcome to Elevator Makeover. Oh Come on in. L'Amour just turned 29, and this is her big year. She is shaking everything up for her last year of her 20s. We'll take great care of her, and there's gonna be a new L'Amour when we're done. Oh my god. She does look a little pale to me, so what I'm gonna do is give her a nice color. She needs to get rid of all those prints and go for some pops of color, and I wanna go like up with her hair. We need to go get that happening right now. Let's take your let's, bag. Yeah, let's uh, take the okay. oh my goodness, coat off. There's go. so much green, I want like an apple right now. <laughs> we're just gonna totally strip what? you. We're not even gonna give you any one. <laughs> Okay, we're gonna put this bright pop of color on here because you definitely need to like brighten things up. Everything was a little bit dull. I loved the fun of the pattern, but we're gonna do fun with color instead of pattern. Are you with me? I'm down. All right, I love let's pink. Color blocking. So we love that. I want to do like a little something up. Slip those off. And I'm gonna hit the yeah. sides of your hair with a little dry shampoo. <laughs> okay. Don't worry, it's not gonna hurt. <laughs> now dry shampoo always turns a little light until it absorbs the oil. Okay. So I'm putting some foundation on your entire skin because I do want a flawless finish. So we hear that this is the year of L'Amour. <laughs> it's your last Yay. year of your 20s. One more before the big 3-0. So this year is sort of all about treating myself good and Figuring out what I want. Nice. Oh my god, we have no time. So I'm spraying your whole ponytail with hairspray. Do you use hairspray? Uh, sometimes. <laughs> sometimes. Hairspray is essential. So I highlighted the high points of your cheeks, top of the nose, and Cupid's bow because this is really gonna bring out your features. And now I'm just contouring, which means basically starting at the top of your ear, going straight down, back and forth, back and forth. And this is really gonna frame your face, okay. so I just love this trick. I'm teasing the crap out of your ponytail <laughs> oh because I want to create lots of hair where you, your hair's kind of fine. Yeah. It's going to look crazy and then it's going to look awesome, promise. What's the process like at the end of the day when I go to take my hair down? <laughs> I don't care about that. <laughs> so now I'm just basically twisting it around. I'm going to start the eyes while you do that and I'm just going to smoke it out just a little bit using shadows. So I'm using a soft brown color all around your lid. This looks really fun, except for there's crazy amounts of flyaways. So here's what I do. I take my little brush, and it's kind of like a toothbrush, but not really, and I spray hairspray on it. And then I can just comb these little flyaways out of the way, and I'm a happy camper. We are How much time there. do we have? This elevator is like the fastest. And just fill in your eyebrows, because it does make a huge difference. It really. Um, again, frames your face, you know, and eyebrows are the most important part of someone's face. Can you put these your earrings hair. on? I do everything, I'll take your shoes off, all that stuff, but I don't do earrings. <laughs> <laughs> it's not my contract, so sorry. Alright, hold that earring, slip this on. Perfection. Look at me. You can always just adjust if it's crooked. Otherwise, you have the leaning tower of bun, like a little off. <laughs> oh, you need booty. Sorry. Yes. <laughs> Black shorty booty. We are super late on this one. Here's... How about I help you? Thank you. All right, yeah, zip it and me. walk. There. Yes, ready? ready? They fit? Yeah. Let's go. Okay. <laughs> ready for the big reveal? Yes. Let's do it. Okay. Whoa. Oh, I really like it. Do you? Yeah. How do you feel? I feel very fancy. <laughs> you see how simple it was? It's yeah. just a fuchsia top and it goes with everything else you're wearing. So I think it's perfect. When you do a really strong pop like that, you don't want to add too much or you'll look a little crazy. Okay. But you can definitely choose like a really bright color like this and just use it in one spot because it just makes you look long and lean and tall. And speaking of tall, yes. I'm giving you a little fun booty moment. Wow. I use two shadows and a big fluffy blending brush. So all you have to do is just literally Go back and forth, back and forth a couple times. Okay. Do the same thing on the bottom lash line. Done. I love it. We think you look fantastic, but yes. I cannot wait to see what Kim thinks. One more, I'm coming. Look at your hair! <laughs> oh my god, you look so good! Thank you! Wait, let me see. Like oh it. my god, you kept the tights. <laughs> we had 
to keep You're something. You're an elevator, right? <laughs> you look amazing. Have so much fun yes. and rock it out this year. Yay! I'm so glad Kim nominated her because how gorgeous did she end up looking? She looked amazing and her skin like really glowed. And her hair looked gorgeous. Her hair was super easy. I showed her how to properly use dry shampoo. We did sort of the bigger bun, which looked really fun on her. I think she felt like really special and fab. Yeah, high five for that. Yeah. <laughs> if you guys think that Lamore owned her new look, please give us thumbs up on this video and... Definitely comment down below and be sure to subscribe to Glamour's YouTube channel for more. Very quick, I got in and they just started taking things off, and I was like, I have no control over any of this. And then I asked them their names. I said I should probably know the names of the people that are stripping me. Right, yeah. that's a good point. Yeah. <laughs>